Hello everyone, welcome. My name is EL Gaming and today I am giving you Warfield update number three. Yes, update number three. This is a huge update. I have done a lot of stuff in the game and you will not believe yourself on how much I have done. Okay, so first things first, we have set up, well I have set up a map, a little training course for you to try out. Um, and it's not really much, it's just a couple of bots that will shoot you, warning you can die. And I really do apologize about the lag. Um, so just to show you, this is the game at Ultra, now I'm putting it at low. Um, but as you can see, the, you see that text saying, check your corners, because trust me, I have put bots in corners that you might not check, so you might want to check those corners. So it's fairly easy, this map, it's not very difficult, you can take it however you want. There is audio in the background, um, just to tell you, um, it, just one thing, it is from the original boot camp, um, so it's not my own voice over, but it is still there. I put it into some good use. I have sound edited, and also one thing that I have also added in is, um, as you can see, there's a bot over here. You shall see its laser right there. Um, and another thing that I finally added in is death. Yes, death. And I have no idea why this thing didn't want to die. Um, so actually, this is fairly. It was a fairly easy course. It was not really much. All that I'm very much going to show you right now is the huge graphics update that I have done. As you can see now we have added in actual bullets now. And as you can see we have bullet drop. Yay! We have bullet drop. So I'm so happy that I finally figured out. It was so easy to do. But it was also sort of ridiculous. So that might come up in a future tutorial. But here we go. So we have bullet drop, I've also added in a new scope, it's the M145 scope um, from my Battlefield 3 references. We have also finally added in first person legs, so now you can see your own feet and see if you can try and shoot them. Most likely not because I have made it impossible for you to shoot them, but you can try. Um, so here is a, a version of the vid of the game. Um, it's not really the best piece, but this is a piece between ultra and low graphics. Low graphics is uh, not that much different from ultra, but ultra just adds in shadows and the textures look better. This is another scene that also shows off the game at its best. We have also added in dirty screen effect, as you can see on the left and the top right. Um, and the flare is very bright, I can see. So just to show you quickly right now, I'm going to show you the multiplayer. I'm starting a server, and you can see my name at the top left, and I'm going to start the match. So just to say multiplayer, I have added in a day-night system. And if you look very carefully, you can see that the shadows are moving. And later in this video, I shall give you a... I shall fast forward it so you can see how fast these shadows actually move. Um, so they're not very fast. The match, the, the whole entire day, you have 5 minutes day, 5 minutes night. So in total, the match should be about 10 minutes long. I've created such a simple map. It's very much copied off base of the first one but I've just added in like mountains and also as you can see we have moving clouds yay so I've worked my butt off on just trying to get this to work and actually I am happy with the results like I am so happy with the results as you can see we have smooth shadow so I've tried making the game look as realistic as possible we still have the laser sight on the M16 A3 and underneath you might not see it because the hand is covering it but underneath we have a flashlight that is for you and yes you once this game finally comes out um, later I'm going to add in a customization system that's going to come in update 4 when the AI is working and yes we do have working AI currently but I am still trying to optimize the script so it looks better. And as you can see, we have moving shadows. You might not be able to see the sun, um, but the sun actually is actually moving. It is moving, but very slowly due to the game actually being 10 minutes long. Um, so, as you can see, the graphics of the game, this is on 
its best literally this is its best right now for multiplayer right now with everything set to ultra we have added in special effects like anti-aliasing and SSAO we have also added in the blur as you can see well yes we have added in motion blur I've just turned it off because um, be <sighs> I, I, it just makes my computer very laggy and it makes it it makes the recording crash um, I really do apologize not getting this in 1080p my recorder um, well the computer my friend's computer couldn't get the um, well my friend couldn't get the gameplay that I wanted to get for you guys what that I wanted to get for you guys so j here's just a demonstration to show you how uh, um, the afternoon would look like in the game as you can see the floor is very dark from all the shadows I've turned off all the um, the sun shafts because the sun shafts really do glitch in the night time so I turned that off um, but besides that as you can see the sky is getting darker and the clouds are still moving and as well the afternoon is now setting so that's that and now in a little bit of time we should see the moon come up yes there is a moon as well so thank you for thank you to me for adding a moon um, so I have to say I'm pretty chuffed with this update it is it has been a huge I repeat a huge update since update 2 um, I have added in n new missions with new sites literally there has been new sites to all the weapons um, all the weapons have now um, I wouldn't say a new recoil but a better recoil I can say um, and the uh, weapons also are acting a little bit more realistically like the muzzle flash I have to say I'm insanely happy with because it's not glitching out anymore it is once it once it has like um how would I put it spawned once the muzzle flash has spawned then it would um go away like almost spontaneously I have made it sort of fake and here I'm going to show you the bullet holes yes we have finally added in bullet holes and I am insanely happy with it um, also another thing that we've also ha added in is bullet shells if you do look out to the right whenever I shoot the gun you should see bullet shells coming out to the right and it does look like that it is a frame it's because I'm only running at about like five frames a second literally due to me running this game at its best now I'm running it at its worst which is fastest and this is what the game looks like yeah the weapon and the arm doesn't really change much but the surroundings around you change dr drastically um, so that's just one thing about the update and all that stuff but hopefully you guys are enjoying this here I'm showing you the SSAO effect I do see that the gun is going through the wall don't worry about it that's gonna be fixed at a later stage but currently right now I'm just working on gameplay and graphics because in this update it was a huge update on graphics um, and the uh, gameplay we have also added in knifing which is a cool implement the only issue right now is it doesn't switch back to your weapon um, and as well I've gotten rid of that ugly HUD at the top left so I'm showing you the daytime you can see that the clouds are moving nicely and the blur effect is coming on whenever we're looking into the very bright sky just tell me whether I should change it I think it looks good and um, the reason why it's looking so bright is because we have it on low but if we had it on the ultra which I am sitting right now you should see that it changes drastically because of the game looking so damn epic I have to say I am amazed with the results I I'm going to further improve this map. The map is currently very small. Um, it's very much like, let's say, a 10 second walk from from the from where you spawn in one direction, and you have very much made it to the end of the map, kind of thing. That's well, I'm talking about running right now. That's how big the map is. And this is quickly showing you the shadows going from night to day. The sun coming out. It is bright. It is just beautiful I there's no other word for it is just beautiful this game so 
Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this commentary. Please tell me what I should add next. And if you have any requests, um, just leave them down below. And subscribe to my channel for later updates. And I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.